Good morning, Franklin. It is time for your top three things. It's Monday morning around 11 o'clock. I'm Eric Stuckey, your city administrator, and it's time for the top three things. On my handy dandy post-it, of course, it's back and ready to go. And I'm here at our police headquarters this morning. We're kicking off uh, an exciting event for everybody. We've got the Teen uh, Citizens Police Academy going on this week. Something that uh, Chief Faulkner and our police department team started a couple years ago. And it brings in over 20 uh, you, young people in the community, youth uh, in the high school age range, and they learn more about what it's like to be a police officer and what a police department does to make a community a safe and great place to live. And so that's what our, our team is doing this week, bringing in over 20 students, teaching them a little bit about what they do and how it functions uh, to be a police officer and how a police department works. So we have those folks with us this week and they're here. Uh, we were gonna have them be part of our top three things, but they're doing a tour of the building right now. So that's the way that goes. Item number two is we shared with you previously that we've got these signs and notifications available at the two downtown city parking garages to let you know what's available. Well, that same information is available online. So if you go to franklintn.gov backslash parking hyphen garage hyphen availability you will get the count of what's available at each of the two parking garages and that may save you a little bit of time if, if you're coming downtown to park and again the city has over 1300 free parking spaces between what's available on the street and what's in our two parking garages over uh, 630 in the parking garages alone so uh, that's an important resource we know and that's another way to streamline give you good information about that Finally, I want to recognize, and I'm wearing my purple tie today, uh, we are uh, acknowledging and sharing information this week in the city, or this month, uh, month of June, for Alzheimer's awareness. So the mayor uh, approved a proclamation presented at the May 22nd board meeting, and Alzheimer's awareness is information we want to share and awareness we want to raise across the community in the month of June. Alzheimer's is uh, the, the kills over 5.5 million people uh, in terms of its, its impact. Uh, it's hard to find a family that hasn't been impacted. Uh, in my family, we lost my father-in-law last November. So it's just something to know about. It's more and more of a need and a demand on families. So many families are impacted, and we wanted to share that awareness, and purple is the color for Alzheimer's. So uh, if you're interested, check it out. We've got more information on our website as well in terms of the proclamation and information about that. So those are your top three things. Teen Police Academy. We've got high school students learning all about police work this week. We've got parking garage information in terms of available spaces available for you both on site and online. And then finally that this is Alzheimer's Awareness Month uh, across the country but especially in the city of Franklin we're getting information out about that. So those are your top three things Franklin. Have a great week.